okay though. Just another rape notice. Oh, strife and pink. Not another rape notice. These rates, they keep going up and up. And frankly, sometimes I wonder whether we get value for money for the rates we pay to this North Vernon Council. Just what the hell the council spends the money on that they collect. Well, how about the $13.2 million upgrade for the Monto, Mundubber and Gainda airports, Bernie? That'll improve services to the region and help the flying doctor. And how many animals in the North Burnett are reunited with their owners or rehomed from council? But I don't even own a dog. Don't tell me my money's going to the dogs. It goes to more than that, darling. Bernie, did you know that council looks after six libraries and more than 16,000 books? What about this? Mount Perry. And there's Arthur. Look at Arthur over there. On the horses. Playground. Crazy day. Toilet. <laughs> Barbecue. Wash off areas. Grey water stinking thing. And what a great <laughs> park. Skate park! I'm too flaming old to use the skate park. Yeah, Bernie, it's a pleasure to work with the North Burnett Regional Council. You can't get away with any tricks here, mate. You've got good buildings in the North Burnett. Bernie, do you realise that the North Burnett Regional Council manages five sewage treatment plants and 95 kilometres of sewage main? That's one great big bucket load. Bernie, stop complaining. We pick up over three and a half thousand bins per week. We do over 1,400 kilometres a week as well. I don't really believe that. That's rubbish. No, darling, that's a fact. What about all these great town halls that the council helps maintain and support? And all the local events they help put on for us? Yeah, Bernie, um, I'm part of Landcare and our interaction with the local council here has been pretty good. We have very regular meetings with them talking about natural resource management. They um, have got a whole team of people. Oh, I didn't really know that. Hey Bernie, what about tourism in the area? Look, there's even a touch screen here so that people can find our local businesses and services. Oh, isn't it wonderful to walk into a centre like this and see all this fantastic local art? Well, actually, Bernie, we have some excellent regional art galleries in our area. What about all this awesome outdoor exercise equipment? Bernie? But Bernie, look at this beautiful pool. It's here for all of us, young and old. Hooray! Bike park, no scooter park, no bike park, no scooter park. We're pretty lucky with the outdoor areas that the council are looking after for us. Look at it, it's beautiful. We've got Mingo Crossing here and we have five platypus in our waters. A ski area at Mundubra, Kenya Dam, sports fields, and you can even hire equipment from Eidsvoll Library for free. What else do you need? No, it's a bike park. No, it's a scooter park. No, it's a bike park. No, it's a scooter park. No, it's a bike park. Yes, and we have some beautiful parks within the North Burnett Regional Council, handled by the, gar the parks and garden boys with the council, plus the volunteers that come in and help do the uh, sprucing up and keep them cleaned and weeded and watered. And It'd um, be pretty muddy in the wet weather if, if we didn't have these walking tracks, Vivian. Council local business on heaps of things to bring tourists to our area. Oh, look at these great paths, Vivian. Yeah, I suppose keeping this park clean and tidy makes sense. Well, Bernie, there is always someone to answer your questions when you ring council on the 1300 MyMBRC number. That's pretty handy. You can do all sorts of things, like make a bus booking, lodge a customer request, or book a community event. The North Burnett Regional Council has done some wonderful things, not only for the SES here in the North Burnett, but for all of the other emergency services. It's probably an instance like this that we're able to show to people, to residents, to ratepayers, that any concerns that they have at a state or federal level, we're more than happy to take it on for them and, and uh, approach those, those people with those concerns and hopefully get the right result back. Bernie, our customer service centres handle dozens of general council service inquiries. Some of our officers are also agents for Centrelink, Medicare and state government departments such as transport, births, deaths and marriages and housing. It certainly keeps us busy. I suppose that makes sense, yeah. Sense. It's more like dollars, love. And Bernie, council even look after you. 
once everybody's out here. Street beautification. Look at our beautiful roses. Come and visit the North Burnett. We have internet in the house. We have a library and Wi-Fi. We have a lot of money to spend here. We have a lot of money to spend here. We have a lot of money to spend here. Smells just like the North Burnett. Hello there. It is that spook. The uh, council have done a big part in the establishing of this particular building. Did you know the North Burnett region's got about 4,000 kilometres of roads? No, I didn't know that. It's like the fourth longest road network in Queensland. And who pays for the maintenance of all that? I suppose it would have to come from rates, wouldn't it? We wouldn't be able to run our business without the clean water the council supplies, Bernie. Someone told me the other day that council has over 123 kilometres of water main to keep track of. That's amazing. Well, I suppose I'd have to concede that the rates we pay are spent widely and we do get value for money and it's, it all helps the community.